but just too little of it, then, you know, just by a lot of videos like this, if I put 15 episodes, this would take me over like a week or so just to upload every single part. So that's why I reason why I want to start it in until I get bored, because then I can upload more different kind of videos. From like, this kind of games I'm playing, like these RPG style ones, to um, shooting games, to fighting games, stuff like those. So yeah. Our first assignment, I finished it up. Yep, there we go. Alright then, let's accept this one right here. Alright then, there we go. So let's check the quest. Uh, just dagger from the wolf pups near the sewers. Alright then. Where are the sewers though? That's what I gotta figure out. Is where the heck is the sewers at? Where are you at? Dougie! Kill it, Dougie! Finish it! Stop attacking me, little puppy! There we go! Puppy line! And I require the... I don't mind needed. Yay! Alright. What the heck is this? Reduces physical defense by 80 points. Oh, he just cast it on me. Alright, let's go back to you and talk about me finishing this quest if I can get down here. Oh, what? I can't get down? That's stupid. There we go. You upgrade your level now, you're level 6. Yay, level 6. Level 6, level 6. So let's. We already got something, and who do we need to talk to? We need to talk to you, return to the deck to Sunny Anna. Alright then, let's go back and return it. Yeah, no, Hannah, no, Hannah. No. Wolf worries. Where am I going? God dang it, I don't want to touch you. Alright, there we go. Let's go back talk to her again. Don't go over there, talk to her. Wolf's worries. So help Hannah to deliver out. Five wolf pups from the outskirts of town, right then. What's your next request here? Oh, it's festival, go. Get five certain corn from the fresh peas, from the mutant seeds, and mutant sprouts, and give them to the town. Alright then, let's go. But yeah. Maybe that's what you can tell me, um, what guys, what do you guys play? What kind of online games did you play? Ever then, how did you find out? What was your first online game that you played? Uh, if I recall the mine, mine was either, you guys say. When I was little, I found, I found out about many games in the past. When I was little, I thought like, eight, nine years old when I found out about these games here. Uh, one of them was, when I was like about, I think, 8 years old, I didn't play it a lot, but, I, I, get, I did play it for a good while, but, when I was like about 8 years old, um, I found a game about, um, a Disney game, you know, Toontown, if you guys know about that game. Um, I played that when I was little, and... Um, I, I had fun playing that game when I was little. And I think I replayed that when I was 10 years old or 11. I replayed that game. But yeah, I will be playing that during this online summer gaming. Uh, because there are some people that might enjoy it. Maybe other people that might not. But yeah. Uh, then it was, um, what was my next game I played? It was... I gotta say it's gonna be um 
Maple Story. Yeah, Maple Story was there. I, uh, yeah, that one I found later on. I played that. I found out more about it. And I uh, had fun playing that when I was more younger. I did a lot of things, but then I got bored throughout the years. And so I didn't want to continue on playing it. Um, and then it was, if I recall, was another Disney game. Uh, VMK, Virtual Magic Kingdom, if you guys heard of it. I played that one, I was like 9 years old. I had really fun of it, if you heard about that. It doesn't exist no more because they shut it down. And... It's not there no more. I had fun times right there because it was mostly about, um... About, you know, you're in mostly Disneyland, and you're, like, in Disneyland, and you're just going, like, to Adventure World, the Adventure Park, uh, Space Island, Space Land, I think. You know, those areas, like, that has, um, um, in Disney. So, that's what I played. It was just mostly, like, a dub, uh, a talkative uh, a game where you just talk and nothing else, not like a combat game, nothing like that. So yeah, I had fun playing that because it was like really interesting, and different from anything I played. Uh, it had like oh, uh, it had like um, you can go to your own rooms, you know, like. Um, if you have your own house, kind of, you know, your own room, and you can make anything up of it, like, um, like your own bedroom, all that stuff, or you can have, like, a little fun area to play with where people can visit it. And so that's what I did. It was fun, and I did many things right there, and it was kind of strange right there because, as well, it was like people that pretended to be, you know, something, you know, because there was like a a room called Get Your Own, like, Little Kid, Get Your Own Little Pets, and it's just like players being those things. It was quite weird, but it was fun, though. Yeah, and then, um... Um... That's what I played, and then it uh, shut down, and there's that, that no more. So that sucks right there. And then later on, I found out more. Yeah, I found out about Korob online. And if you heard about that game, it was mostly just like a, kind of a this game, it's a combat game, like RPG game like that. And that was my like my most favorite uh, online game I played. Because of it's uh because it was really fun because uh, I played it so much. Uh, I was like I recall I was a sorcerer and um, I got to level about level 80, 90 somewhere right there. And uh, yeah, and then I met some. And then I joined the guild in that game, man. Um, uh, I then um. In that guild, though, we went to to do a quest together, you know, helping each other out and all that stuff. And then um, we went to we did a lot of, like boss quests, you know, to fight the bosses and all that stuff. And but and me and my friends were all having fun always like that because because one time we went to a witch and uh, he, we just saw that that was his wife. She was like, the witch was ugly. And he was like, yeah, that's my wife, is she hot? And stuff like this. That yeah, was funny and all that. We did many more things. Right there. That's why we enjoyed it. Uh, Corum, Corum, um, is not there no more. They shut down, they shut that game down as well. I don't know why, but it was a really great game. I don't know if now would be a great game because. Uh, my, I'm older now, as you know that, and...
and um, we and you know you're never sure if that game is bad again or is a good game. You know you're never sure. So yeah, that's what mostly I was thinking about that. And yeah, so I just want to wonder, you guys, if. If you had any games like those that were fun memories of any good game that you played in the past that doesn't exist no more, maybe you can tell me in the comments below. Because I just want to know more games out there that doesn't even, isn't there no more. Or like that stuff. Or maybe tell me online, or tell me how much online games did you play during these years or something. Well, oh, wait, someone's crying around there. Okay, we're about to die here. Come here, you know, just mess. Whatever you're doing, you're right there, bro. You're about to kill him. Die, you ready. And there you go, yeah. Alright then, so let's go return those quest back and do some more stuff. Um we think I'm recording I think I'm already at about fifty minutes already so far, so we're about to be over with this. Unless I don't feel like unless I'm gonna do more or something like that. So yeah, so let's go talk to her up here. Where the heck is she? Hey, hey Anna, where are you? Where the heck are you? What the f where are you? She? God dang it, where are you? Hey Anna, where the heck are you? Oh cool, that's awesome, I gotta say that. It takes you to the area where they are at. 